Hi guys, it's Lisa. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is July month, so I'm going to do my July and June favorites for you guys. And look who I have here. It's Angel. This is Angel. Hi. Say hi guys. Hi. I'm helping mom do her makeup. Hi. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> She's a cutie. Give me kisses. Give me kisses. Oh. Okay. Bye. Bye, down. Okay, guys. <laughs> Besides the adorable puppy that's here, my mom's dog. Alright, so I'm going to do. I'm going to do my June and July favorites. Everything, not everything, but you know, I've got. I picked out some stuff that. I've been using and loving and adoring and I'm going to share with you guys. So, if you guys want to see what I'm going to be sharing, I have all my favorites here. If you guys want to see what it is, then you guys can keep watching. Okay. I'm guessing the first thing we're going to start with is the glow palette because this is what I'm using right now hello it's my newest glow I think yeah so this is what I'm using right now this is the glow kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills the sun dipped one so this is what it looks like it has four shades bronzed summer tourmaline and moonstone and my favorite color is clearly summer that's the one that's most dipped in and that is my favorite color right now. I love, love, love this palette. Great job, Anastasia. And I love the back too because they just have like the four colors and the names. And it's just so glittery and cute. I love it. So that's first up. Okay, second, I have this little tiny Quo palette. Look at the designing. I love it. I have a bigger eyeshadow palette that goes with the collection too. But this is what I'm using right now. This is a brow palette. This is what I do my brows with every single day right now. This is what I'm loving. It has the little tiny thing with it, the side to do your brows with, and then the side to spool them out. So it comes with a nice mirror, and it comes with the two shades. It has a darker and a lighter, which is perfect. In the middle, there's a highlight. I don't use the highlight that much, but it is a really good highlight, believe it or not. I should start using it. And then at the end, this is like the cream, you know what I mean? That keeps it all up nice. I love the cream. If I didn't have the cream, I don't think I'd use it. But I love, love, love this eyebrow palette. And then this is the darkest one. Yep, the darkest one in the quote. And this is quote. So, love it. Next, on to the third one. <laughs> okay, so this is just the eyeshadow palette by CoverGirl. The True Naked One Roses. I don't know why I just love this palette. I'm always reaching for it. I don't know why I have so many palettes, but I always find myself reaching for it. I don't know why. I guess it's because the colors are really pigmented. Not gonna lie. Look at that. Swatch a quick couple. Like, look at that pigmentation. Yeah. That's why I love it. So that's just the CoverGirl True Naked Rose Palette. Look at those swatches. That's clearly why I love it. <laughs> All right. Okay, on to the fourth thing that I'm loving right now. Okay, so this is the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Skin Frost in the shade Ice Cold. So yeah, this is my other highlighter that I'm loving right now. I actually wear the two of them all the time. I'll go with that one first, the, this one, I'll put summer on, and then I'll go in with this one and put this one on top. I don't know why, it's just beautiful. Look at that ice cold. Love it. First Jeffree Star purchase, so you know your sister's loving it. <laughs> okay, so that was the fourth. On to the next, number five, my fifth thing I am absolutely loving right now. Okay, so this is another glow. See what I'm like? So this is a rainbow glow. So this is an AOA Lab 
is what the name is, AOI Studio Lab. Look at this glow! I guess I can give her a swatch for you guys. So I'm basically swatching just like, you know, up and down, up and down. Oh, can you see that? Yeah, it's beautiful. So it's like a rainbow glow. You can really use any color you want if you think about it, but I mixed some and it came out like a bluey color. It's actually really nice. So this is one of my favorites also right now. Like look at that packaging though. It got like diamonds, lips, like everything. I love it. So that's also something I'm loving right now. How many is that? One, two, three. Okay, on to the next one. Number six. Six thing that I'm loving right now. Okay, so I only got this the other day. I used it like three times. I did a tutorial on this actually. Just posted it up today. I will link that below if you want me to. This is the e.l.f. lips. I don't know, this is the e.l.f. eyes, lips, and face eyeshadow palette. Guys, I don't know what else to tell you, but I am loving this right now. It's all I want to use. Like, I swear to God, I feel like this is all I want to use on my eyes right now. The look I have done right now is actually from this. I love it. Like, the colors are so creamy, so smooth. I'll swatch a couple. Oh, like, they're just so creamy. I swear. Look at that. These colors are beautiful, guys. And look, oh my God, so creamy, I kid you not. Look at that rose gold, they're so creamy. I swear. And I think, okay, it's like 38 shades or 36 shades in this. Look at those colors. And I paid, I think, like $12, no more than 15 bucks for all these shades. So that's just a couple swatches right there to show you guys. It's beautiful. So that's why it's one of my favorites right now. So that's e.l.f. too, by the way. So loving that. It's really nice. Oh my god, actually also from e.l.f., what I am loving right now, using this to the nines. This is the e.l.f. Matte Magic Mist and Set Spray. Guys, girls, whatever comes out beautifully it smells fresh beautiful oh I love it and it works good my makeup stays all fucking day I'll tell you that right now don't even move love it it's so much. okay so that's what one two three four five six seven thing we're going on to the eighth thing here guys all right next up is a foundation that I'm absolutely loving this is the Marcel flawless parfait <laughs> This is a Skin Fusion Foundation, Auto Adapting Pigment, Oil Free, All Day Wear, and Hydrating. My shade right now is Buff Beige. Guys, girls, it has a pump. This is a glass bottle, so heavy, luxurious. It is a bit expensive, I'm not gonna lie, but I love it. I love the pump, I love it. Oh, it's beautiful, beautiful foundation. So this is the Marcel too y'all want to know so that is number eight on to the next one moving right along here <laughs> okay so now I have a primer guys this is oh my favorite right now this is a May sheer base Maju <laughs> transforming smoothing primer so uh, on the back is Chinese I ordered this online for like five bucks I thought it was going to be bigger. It's only small. I have another one on the way. It's that good. I'm not even kidding. Look, it's almost gone. It got this light scent. Like, it's almost like a light, 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 beautiful scent. I don't even know how to describe it, but it's like a... And it's that creamy between your fingers and, like, moist. And this is my all-time favorite moisturizer. I right, moisturizer. I think it's almost like a moisturizer, it feels like, but it's not. It's a primer. And it's so nice. I have another one on the way right now because this one's almost gone and I do not want to run it. Number nine. <laughs> okay, on to the next. Number ten, guys. I have a concealer. This is a Joe Fresh concealer. Look how small it is, but I love it. So it says, Long Wear Spot Concealer. 
full coverage. So, what shade is this? Don't even say. Yes, it is. I don't know. But it just comes out like this. You squirt it out the little thing like that. This concealer. I'm going to tell you. I love it. Because it covers whatever you want. Like, I'm not even kidding. Look at that. Okay. I should have put it on my tattoo. I'm an idiot, I know. But it's a really good concealer. This is what I'm using right now. It's Joe Fresh, ladies. Joe Fresh. I got it at Dominion. Their foundation, too, is beautiful. I don't have it here, but I do have it close to buy. Joe Fresh. And look how big it is. I think it was like nine bucks. This and this together, it does wonders. But that's not for my favorite, just saying. Okay, on to the next. That was number 10. Number 11. Okay, we're going to do some lipsticks. This is a L'Oreal Paris lipstick, guys. It's the Collection Exclusive Dija Lija. I don't know. But it's 360 Lias Nude. Yep, is what it's called. Look at the packaging. Super cute. Love it. Look at this color. That's a nice color, guys. I kid you not. So let's do a swatch, eh? Right? I cannot swatch it up that far. I may crack it. Guys. Look at that. I love it. I love that lipstick. And this one don't dry like a matte, like you know what I mean? Like a matte finish like this one I have on and nothing comes off. It's not like that. But I love this lipstick. I think I paid like $13 or $14 L'Oreal Paris, but love it. Next lipstick here we have AOA Studio. Okay, AOA Studio Wonder Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade, this one is Tease. Oh, love it. Is this one I have out right now? No, it's not. But this is a beautiful color, guys. I'll swatch this for you, too. Look at that. So nice. It's almost probably all gone. because I Look, it's mangled because I use this that much. Okay, let me build it back now. But it's that nice mauve shade. Love it. And that is a matte, draws down as a matte. Beautiful. Next up, we have an e.l.f. lipstick. This isn't a lipstick. It's like a, a lipstick, but it's like a glass, too. It's beautiful, actually. So what shade? We're working with the shade Scott. <laughs> All those Scots out there. I'd be wearing you on my lips. Not. <laughs> okay, so I'll swatch this for you guys. It's like a beautiful pinky glassy. Oh, I love it. Look at it. So fucking nice. Look at that color though. Okay. It's like a pink. I love it. Elf Cosmetics. Okay. Next up. This is the one I have on right now. Actually, this is a ultra matte Quee Vest matte liquid lipstick. I'm going to reapply. It's just like a nice, nudie. Uh, I just love it. Okay, I probably didn't need to apply it that many times, but I did. So there's your swatch. <laughs> Kidding. <laughs> I'll still swatch it. It's beautiful though. Just eat it. It's that beautiful. Fourth one down. Love it. That's a nice color, guys. I just love like the nudie mavi colors. So neat. Okay, on to the next one. Next lipstick I have is a NYX lingerie in the shade Teddy Da. This is my new favorite color in the NYX lingerie's, and I have a couple of these, so. Oh, look at that brown. Look at that brown and that pigment, though. Beautiful. I just love NYX. So creamy, so smooth, too, when you put them on, just oh, all around. Good lipstick. Two more lipsticks left, guys, and my favorites here. Next up, we have a ColourPop Ultra Matte. 
in the shade Limbo. This is also a brown, because you know me, loving my browns. Okay, let's see. swatch your petal for you. Woo, this one's like a darker brown, though. Much. Love it. There we go. Last one down. So I think we're on number 16, I'm guessing. I don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, another. Ah, I was right. That was number 16. Okay, so there's the ColourPop shade Limbo right there. On to number 17. This is the last lipstick that I'm loving right now. This is one of the Maybelline New York's new one. These are the Super Stay Matte Inks. The only one I have like it. So in the shade 45. What? Escapist or something? I don't know. But it's nice. This is like a dark purple. Yeah. Really thick too. Like, I don't know. I feel like I love it. Yes. But it's really thick. It's a thick consensus consistency. <laughs> So here's the color, it's like a dark purple. Love it. That is the last lipstick, number 17. So that's the 17th favorite of June and July. All right, on to number 18. So I have this brush, this is, oh, I ordered this the other day, not the other day, but I had it for like a month now. This is an AOA Studio a F19. So this is a highlighting brush. This is my favorite highlighting brush right now. I have like, you know what I mean? I obsessed over this one. This was my favorite for a while. I had a couple, but this right now is my all time favorite highlighting brush. It's just ah, so soft, so beautiful. Makes it poppin'. I'm gonna tell you, I just wanna swatch it and do it right now. Okay, so that's a highlighting brush and that is the F19. Love it. So that's a fave right now. I have another brush. This one don't have a name, but this is just my foundation brush, guys. Like, this is how it looks, straight across, nice kabuki, flat. I love it. I use this to put my foundation on. Love it. So this is my favorite foundation brush right now. I use this daily. I wouldn't be able to live without it. So. This is an ultimate fave right now. If you haven't tried putting your foundation on with a brush, sister, you better get on it. Don't forget to squirt some water and you'll be a-okay, I promise. Okay, on to the next one. So this was number 19. Number 20 fave of the month. My beauty blender, even though I have a whole bunch, but this one, guys, I wish you can just feel how soft squishy and oh my god it's just so nice and look it's heart shaped so I just love this one because it's so oh it's a really good beauty blender it blends everything out beautifully I love it this is like my ride or die right here both of these <laughs> okay so that was what number 20 I'm thinking I don't know not many more things left to go but next number 21 I have this this is also AOA Studio, but it goes on two of your fingers like this, and it's an egg brush cleaner. This has saved my life, I swear to God. So you just, when you're cleaning your brushes or whatever, you just go to town on this, and it has like grooves that go that way, and then it has little ones up there, good ones to get your brush into for cleaning. It's brilliant. I paid one dollar for this, like does wonders this is an all-time favorite right now <laughs> number 21 that is all right number 22 ladies Swiss Army I knew about a Swiss Army for men one of my ex-boyfriends used to wear a Swiss Army and I used to just want to breathe it lick it inhale it eat it I'm telling you it smells so fucking good every time he wore it I just wanted to lick them up and down it smelled so fucking good Recently, look what I found. Look what your girl has found. Okay, I'm crazy. <laughs> this is a for her Swiss Army. And I'm gonna tell you, it smells beautiful. Like, oh. 
Guys, girls, if you haven't tried Swiss Army for Women, get your hands on this. It's a bit pricey, yes, but it's hella worth it. Get your man the Swiss Army for Men and get you the Swiss Army for her and you guys will be smelling on point. That's a promise. Okay, so this was number 22 maybe? 23? I don't know. On to the next one. <laughs> okay, next favorite right now. <laughs> This is a Hawaiian Tropic Oil Spray, guys. I use this for tanning. It smells fucking unreal. I gotta stop swearing on it. Smells like coconuts. Oh my God, I'm telling you. This is just a tanning oil, but it's my favorite one. I have a bunch more. I've tried a whole bunch, but this one right here, ladies, this is it. I'm telling you. It says, it's a moisturizing sunscreen too, so you know what I mean? UVA protection. You got SPF, obviously, like with ex moisturizing formula with exotic island botanicals. So, ah, if you want to get your bronze on, ladies, like in that sun, this is going to be your best friend. Mm -hmm. All right, so that was number 23. I don't know. We're in the 20 something. But this is it. This is the last few things I have to show you guys. Yay! So, of course, some Mary Kay. Ladies, I have switched up my face game right now to these Mary Kay things have been doing my face wonders. Okay, I've been using some other things before for my face, like, you know what I mean, when, you're when you take off your makeup and you're putting on your moisturizers and that stuff for your face. So I switched it up to, this is the Timeless Mary Kay 3-in-1 Cleanser. I'll read you this one first. So, this is for normal to dry skin, suitable for sensitive skin, fragrance free. This is what I love about it. I hate anything that has any kind of fragrance in it for your face. Uh-uh, not for me. Especially when moisturizing and cleaning and that, and exfoliating, no, I don't want any fragrance. Non-comedenic. Okay, so it cleanses, it exfoliates, freshens, three-in-one cleanser, gently cleans away impurities as it begins the process to erase the visible signs of aging and restore the look of your younger skin. Guys, girls, it's actually changing my skin. I kid you not. I love it. Oh, I put a pour on my face. Okay, so then when you do this, this is step, step number one. After you do that, wipe it off. Your face feels a hundred. Like, I'm not even kidding you. I've tried that much shit on my face now. It's insane. And this is the fucking game changer for me. Then, after that, we have the Mary Kay Time Wise Age Fighting Moisturizer. So, this is a hydrant content. And it says, I'll read to it. Age Fighting Moisturizer, normal to dry skin, suitable for sensitive skin, oil and fragrance free. It says, Time Wise Age Fighting Moisturizer firm, softens, and reduces the appearance of fine lines. Proven to hydrate to up to 10 hours. Okay, ladies. So, when I put this on, moisturize my face. Two of this together. I don't know. I haven't had a pimple since. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. But I love it. My face ain't dry anymore. I have a state made because of all these swatches. But that's normal, typical me. All over the table here, there's nothing but lipstick. I better not have any on my dress. Okay, guys, that is it for my June and July favorites and everything I have been loving right now. That was a lot. This is probably a long video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I love you guys all so much. You guys are the ones and the reason why I do this. I love doing it, and you guys are the reasons why. So, thank you all for watching. Do not forget to subscribe, give it a thumbs up, a thumbs down if you hate it, whatever it is. But know that I love you guys, and thanks for watching. Bye, guys.